What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to share your Android screen to your PC or how to remote and into your Android device from your PC. So first thing we need to do, we need to get on our computer and we need to go to a browser and we need to go to teamviewer.com and I'll put link in the description below. Then we need to scroll down and we need to click on download for free. That's a team viewer free version. Once we get to the screen, we need to click on save file. And once the download is complete, we need to click on team viewer setup. And right here at this pop-up box, we need to click run. And right here, I'm not going to install this program. So I'm just going to click on run only. And this is personal non-commercial use and then click accept and run. Then we're going to get the screen. So once this part is done, now we need to get on our cell phone and we need to open Google Play Store. And in Google Play Store, we need to type Team Viewers. And then once we get to this page, we need to scroll down and we need to download Team Viewers Quick Support. And then click Install. Okay, once the installation complete, you can click on Open. And then right here, click Done. And then click on Activate. Accept Terms and Conditions and click Confirm. So now what we need to do, we need to use this ID number. We need to put this ID number right here into our computer. And then we need to click on connect. And right here, we need to click allow. And then click start now. And now we can see our Android device on our computer. What you can do, you can either maximize this or you can click on this button right here. And then you're going to be able to see your Android on a full screen. And then you can click on this arrow and this bar is going to disappear. And now you can control your phone with your mouse. So we can go to back to Play Store. We can go back or we can go back to our screen and you can do what you need to do. And if you try to make videos or something, this is a perfect way to do it. Or if you're trying to help somebody with the Android device remotely, help them to set up something or troubleshoot something, this is the best and free way to do that. If this video was helpful to you, smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.